One out of three women in Namibia have experienced or will experience gender-based violence in their lifetime. To make matters worse, it is estimated that one out of five women are in an abusive relationship. Besides physical and mental harm, victims of gender-based violence might not be able to work due to injuries. To address this, women from churches in the Karas region converts at the Kietmans of African Methodist Episcopal Church joined by their male counterparts. Dear mothers, we need to find ways to protect our homes and community against the evils of society, such as domestic violence, alcohol and drug abuse, teenage pregnancies, and everything that makes our community backwards. Although there has been a reduction in recorded cases of gender-based violence compared to previous years, the lack of male involvement in advocating for women's rights is still very low. Women are the salt of this earth. There should be encouragement to you as women. Even though at times you feel marginalized, your purpose and your worth is undeniable. Women at the gathering vow to continue their advocacy for their rights and to condemn violence against vulnerable members of society. Many of us are in attendance here today. My hope is that we will continue in the same spirit during 2018. We are glad to witness so many faces. This is a testimony that women can come together, united, for a change. A candle was lit to celebrate the 40th anniversary of the existence of the Ecumenical Women's Prayer Group in Kietmanswap. Natang with Jimmy NBC News, Kietmanswap.